<laughs> Thank you, Steve, for reminding me. Good morning, Pamela. Great to see you today. Morning. Well, wait a minute. Maybe is that Pamela or did Pamela? Yeah. Did you see? Are you an imposter? You have different <laughs> haircut. That's great. That's great. Looks good. Thank Looks you. good. All righty. So right here, guys, we want to stay right there. We're moving towards 80 RPMs, moving towards 80 RPMs. So once you get there, just hold that. Don't go any faster. Don't go any faster. Just keep the resistance on warm-up gear only. So we're going to give ourselves eight minutes. Then we're going to move into stage one. And we're going to continue to work. And we're going to work to our potential today and beyond. So it's like, what is the buzz <laughs> lightly? What's the buzz light year? Yeah, kind of. To infinity and beyond. There we go. We got it. We got it. I remembered it. Great. So it's Ooh. not like we're gonna do that quite today, but it's gonna be fun. It's gonna be really fun. So let's get ready to go ahead and start picking up that pace. If you're ready, go ahead and pick up that pace towards 80 to 85. So you're still if you're still working to 80, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Once you're ready to go, go ahead and start bringing it up towards 81, 82, and so on, up towards 85. Good morning, Deborah. <laughs> Great to see you today. Good morning. Good. And thank you for my, this is beautiful. You, you did this yourself? Yes, I did. That is gorgeous, Deborah. Oh, thank my you. gosh. You are so talented. <laughs> thank you for that. That's beautiful. You're welcome. Great. Okay, so we're going to stay here for about another 90 seconds. So Deborah, we're, we're going to work hard today, but we're going to give ourselves plenty of time to warm up. Okay, so we're going to ask you to be working hard today because we are increasing Lori's BDNF in her brain. This is all Lori today. And uh, we're going to try to try to um, blow out that uh, tremor. How's that? How's that? Okay, good. Good. Blow it out. Blow it out. That's right. Wouldn't it be great? Wouldn't it be great? Yeah, exactly. One more minute to go. So you're closer. If you're closer to 85 than 80, great. If you're still on your journey up towards 80 and you're not quite there, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Just continue working to your potential today. Great job. So this is going to be a great class. It's going to be a great class. It's going to be an efficient ride. You know exactly where you need to be for the first 20 minutes. Once we get to the 20 minutes, we'll take a break. We'll get it hydrated and then we'll hit that big intensity six minute block. And that's what we're going for today. That's what we're going for. Our journey has been nice. It's been nice up until now. It's not been easy, but we found what we needed to find before we work on this class. And that's exactly what we're going to do today. All righty, 10 seconds to go. So if you're closer to 85, then 80, brilliant. If you're still working your way towards 85, stay there and can continue your journey. But when you're ready, and if you're there, I'd like for you to start lifting 85 to 90 RPMs. 85 to 90, no faster than 90. We've got a minute here. We've got a minute here. So what I want you to do is really set that foundation for real good success. Shoulders down, chest up. I want you to feel like you can stabilize yourself on that saddle. And I want you to be able to allow those legs to work to their potential today. Good. Let's not get in the way of our legs today. Let them work to their potential. All right, good. A lot of times, you know, we try to take over and we don't want to do that. We want to just let go of any thoughts that might be inhibiting our success today. Everyone will be successful no matter what. 20 seconds to go, stay right there. Good job, excellent job, wonderful job. Okay, so now you've got 10 seconds here. If you're at 90, great. If you have been working your way up into 85 or 90, continue your journey. Those of you who have been able to get to 90, add one more resistance turn, slow it to 70. We're gonna wait for the rest of you here. We're going to wait for the rest of you here. Okay. So if you haven't come to 90 RPMs or anywhere close, you're continuing that fast pedaling. But if you've hit that 90 RPMs and you could hold that for that amount of time, then you can pull back to 70 and you've added a resistance turn. Does everyone understand what I just said? Yes. All right. Next very good. I need to hold 94. I'm going to ask you to hold it for 30 more seconds. Okay, 
But if you have already at 90, Pamela, you can pull back, all right? You can pull back if you've been able to make it to 90. All righty, so hold it right here. You've got 15 seconds to go. All righty, we're holding it at 70 RPMs or pulling it back to 70 RPMs. We're gonna hold that, we're gonna grab a drink. All righty, five, four, three, two, now one. Okay, 70 RPMs, I'm gonna have you grab a drink of water. Now get back on your, get back on the road, 70 RPMs, start here. So if you've, if you've come back to 70, you've added one resistance turn. So go ahead, everyone, make sure they have one more resistance turn than their warm up gear. All right, good. All right, got a four minute block, four minute block, 80 RPM, start lifting and holding at, to, at 80 RPM. Now this is our fact finding mission today. This is our fact finding part of the class. This is our heart rate. We're searching for heart rate right here. I believe that would make a good movie, don't you? Searching for heart rate. I think that that would be on a Hallmark or E, don't you? Yeah, I do. I do. Okay. All right. Searching for heart rate. That's us. 80 RPMs. You've got warm up gear plus one on board, unless you're still working towards 80 RPM. Okay. All right. Good job. Everyone okay so far? Yes. Yeah. So far, so good. Great. 20 more seconds to go. Now, March, we're going to monitor that heart rate. Okay. We're going to monitor that heart rate for this through this first stage. 10 seconds to go. Good. So if you're at 80 RPMs and your effort seems to be a fairly easy journey for right now, I'm going to have you kick up an acceleration towards 85. Just change the RPM, change the RPM. Now, once again, pull it back, please, to 80. Hold right here. So we still have warm-up gear plus one on board. How's everyone's heart rate handling this? Is everyone doing okay? Yes. Good, good, good. Okay, so we're going to stay here for another 45 seconds. We're going to accelerate again and pull back to 80. All right, this is going to be done three more times, just like that. All right, searching for heart rate. That's what we want. All right, keep it right here, guys. Remember, we're not going to start working really hard until we're about the 20 minute, um, 20 minute mark in this class. And if we need longer, we'll take longer. It's, it's okay. All right. 18 seconds to go. You're at 80 RPMs. One more time. We're going to pick up that pace. Get ready. You're going to monitor that heart rate as you accelerate. Okay, in five seconds, get up towards 85, if not slightly past 85. Let's go now. Let's go now. Just so give it an acceleration. Norma, how you doing, sweetie? You doing okay? Hey, yeah. Okay, good, good. Okay, get ready to add one resistance turn. Okay, turn to the right, slow it back to 80. All right, you've got another minute right here. All right. So now you've got warm up gear plus two on board if you were able to accelerate. Watch your heart rate through this minute. All right. We are only 11 minutes, 10 minutes, 11 minutes into class. We're still in oxygen deprivation. We're putting a lot of load on that, that, uh, those legs. So what we want to do is we want to monitor it. Of course, perceived exertion could run ahead of where your heart rate is. Chances are that's going to be about where you're going to be at the end of this stage. All right. So perceived exertion is going to be running higher. We know how that feels. We know how it feels. We find that. We accept it. We look at our heart rate. We move on, right? Okay. Eight more seconds to go. We'll have another acceleration just to get off our 80 RPM hill. Here we go. Let's go ahead. Accelerate towards 85, if not higher. Hold this. We've just got about five more seconds here. Our last load's coming now. Last load's coming. All right. One more resistance turn. You've got 80 RPMs. You're slowing now to 80 last minute of the stage. All right. Now, chances are warm up plus three is too much for you. If it is, don't worry about it. Drop back on the resistance, okay? 80 RPMs. That's what our goal is right here. Can everyone maintain 80 RPMs? 
Yes, good. Marge, what's happening to your heart rate? 105. 105. Carol, what's happening to your heart rate? I'm okay. Oh, you don't have a heart rate manager. Where's your output? Where's your output, Carol? 38. 38. Okay, I think we're okay, don't you? Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, great. All righty, good job. 15 more seconds to go. All righty, we're just gonna pull back. You're gonna, you're gonna take your resistance off, but you're gonna remember where you were right now. All righty, take your resistance off, slow it to 70 RPMs. Okay, grab your water. Good job. Anyone have uh, margins is 105? Pamela, what's yours? 122. Okay, okay. Okay, good. Susan, what was yours? 122. Are you kidding? That's funny. Carolina, what was yours? 99. Mm -hmm. Lori? 117. Okay, okay. Phil? 119. Okay, Steve? 127. Okay, oh, okay. That's pretty good. That's pretty good, good. Stacy, how about you? 111. 111, great. Norma? 80. 80, are you kidding me? Really? Okay. All right, that's good. Mike, how about you, sweetie? Mike? 101. 101. Deborah, where was yours? 123. 123. Okay, that's really great. You guys were do doing absolutely fantastic. Carolina, what was yours? 99. 99, I said that. Okay, I just want to make sure I didn't miss you again. <laughs> All righty, guys, here we go. 80 RPMs, go back. Put the same resistance you had on your last effort. Okay, so what I've got now is I've got a six minute stage here that's going to take us out to where I want to begin the hard work. So 80 RPM, same resistance you had on your last effort. Marge, I'm going to ask you not to add any more resistance. I'm not going to, I don't want you to add any more resistance. Carol, you're going to monitor that as well because you're going to have to go with that perceived exertion and power output or whatever you want to kind of guide yourself through this. Susan, we're going to start lifting these heart rates up higher than what we did last week, okay? Mm -hmm. So are you okay with that? Yep. All right, good. Deborah, monitor it as well there, okay? Pamela, 122 is excellent. We're going to, we're going to be lifting this heart rate up a little bit higher shortly. Not yet, not yet. So whatever I show, I asked you to remember for your aerobic threshold numbers, wherever those numbers were, I want you to find that and I want you to stay there for the next three minutes. So whatever you need to do, Lori, whatever you need to do. Now, if you need to accelerate because you're more efficient with your acceleration, do that to monitor the heart rate. If you need to add more resistance on and stay at 80 because 80 feels best for you, I want you to do that. We've got lots of choices here, but the idea is to bring your heart rate up to your aerobic threshold and hold it. Steve, where are you going to call that today? Love you, Love you Norma. You're going to call it 130, 135? think i think don't you i think well, about 142 you, okay oh. you want to you want to say that's your at your aerobic threshold 142 yeah okay are you okay to go higher than that today um i'm not sure okay that's okay i still got, I still got a little bit they're messing with my my meds right so right. my tremor is Okay. All right, kiddo. Don't worry about it then. Don't worry about it. All righty. So we are almost there, guys. We're all yes, yes, Pamela. Um, I don't remember what my aerobic threshold. One twenty-two. Okay. Yeah, that's what it was. One twenty-two. That was perfect. Yeah, you know, Mar we're yes. March. March was one oh nine, I believe. One oh nine. Thank you. Yeah, you're welcome. Anyone else? Yes, me. Stacy, oh my gosh, are you sure you want me to tell you? It was well, like one, 128 to 131. Yeah, that's like that. Okay. Yeah, Susan, do you, remember? do you remember? I, yeah. I was just hoping they changed. <laughs> they went a little lower. Yeah, that's funny. 
Susan, you remember where you need to be? Yes. Okay, great. Okay, anyone else need help? All right, one more minute, guys. So you've either accelerated, Lori, what's your heart rate right now? 116. 116. Okay. What what's your resistance? Um 38. 38. Okay. What's your RPM? 80. 80. Can you scoot it up towards 85? I can. All right, do it or go to the show when we were starting this. So don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. And you know what? If this doesn't work today. No, we'll do it again. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. It's cool. All righty. 18 more seconds to go, guys. I want everybody to find their heart rate, okay? Find their heart rate. In 10 seconds, we're going to take a recovery, okay? All righty. Five seconds. You're going to remember your resistance, and you're going to get your heart rate and begin now. Do both and then recover. 70 RPS. Great. 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 Okay, Phil, what was yours? 122. 122, where's your resistance? 33. 33, great. Helena, how you doing? Are you doing okay? Thumbs up if you are. You good? Yeah, okay, great, great. Steve, where were you at the end there? Oh, 127. Okay, great, super. At 30. My, oh, at 30, okay, great, super. Mike, how about you? 103 at 23. That's perfect. Norma? Uh, 81. 30. Okay, thank Okay. 87. Okay, all right. That's good. I like that better. Great. Stacy, where were you? 116 at 33. Oh, kiddo. Okay. <laughs> Carol, how you doing? Good. Yeah, I was right. at 37. Okay, great. Great. Lori, what was yours at the end there? 122, yeah. 88. At 80, okay, great, super, super. And what was your resistance? It was 38. 38, okay, so you increased your cadence, right? I yeah. increased both a little. That's good, that's wonderful. Carolina, how about you? 104 at plus three. Plus three, wow. Marge, where were you at the end? 109, uh, and I was back to warm up, so. That's okay. It's all right. I want you to do that. I want you to do that. Good. Susan, how about you at the end? 132 plus three at 85. There. Oh boy. That's great. That is super duper. You're ready. Pamela. Oh, Pamela's on the phone. Deborah. 135 at eight. Okay, kiddo. Let's be mindful of that because we're getting right there where you need to be. That's absolutely great. All right, guys. I got everybody right. Pamela will join us when she's ready. All righty, guys. All right, here we go. Here we go. 85 RPMs, 85 RPMs. We've got a six minute block right here. I want you to go to 85 RPMs utilizing the resistance you had on the last effort. So right away, if you accelerated to get that heart rate, Lori, that's you're gonna get back up there again. All right. Now, what I want you to do is I want you to monitor your heart rate right here. I want you to monitor your heart rate at 85 with the same resistance. If you go higher than 109, Marge, you're going to slow down to 80. Okay. okay. If anybody is not where they need to be in two minutes, we're going to pick it up to 90. We're going to meet the aerobic threshold. Okay. Okay. Let's go now. Now. We're not doing, we're not doing the hit yet. We're not doing hit yet. Okay. We're just getting ready to, to perform the way we want to perform. You're at 85 RPMs utilizing the same resistance you had on your last effort. Once you get to the heart rate, your aerobic threshold heart rate, I want you to slow it back to 85, 80 RPMs and just sit on it and sit on it. All right. See what happens. Does that make sense? Yes. All right. So, Once you so get there. So past, eight, past yeah. 85 to get to the threshold? If you're not, if when I say what's your heart rate after two minutes, if you're not at 135 again, Deborah, you'll pick it up towards 90, okay? Because okay. we want to push those heart rates up again. We want to push those heart rates up again. Helena, you're going to do exactly what you need to do. Don't worry about keeping up with us, love, because it's been 20... It's been 22 minutes. You're welcome to pull back and recover. Okay. 
Okay. All right. How's everybody doing? You're a little over a minute into it. Is everyone good? Yes. All right. Has anyone met their aerobic threshold? Not yet. Okay. Keep going. We've got 44 more seconds to go. 44 more seconds to go. You're at least at 85. Okay. If in 35 seconds you haven't met your aerobic threshold number, you're going to increase your cadence to 90. If you have met your aerobic threshold number, slow it back towards 80 and just hold it there. Just sit on it at 80. Okay. Because chances are, okay, Lori, you got it. Okay, pull it back to 80. Pull it back to 80 and just hold it now. Anyone else? All right, yeah, Marge has me. got it. Susan's got it. Deborah, great. Carolina, great. Hold it at 80. Just hold it at 80. All right, we're two minutes in. Everyone okay? Everyone else still working to get there? If you're not, if you don't have your aerobic threshold now, you got to pick it up to 90. You got to get there. You got to get there. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. You guys are so prepared for this. You can do it. You can do it. Stacy, what's your heart rate? 122. 122. Keep going at 90. Keep going at 90. The rest of you stay at 80 RPMs and keep your heart rate right where you need to keep it. So chances are, when you pull back to 80, you had a little rebound heart rate, catching up, catching up to the muscle fiber recruitment, slowing it down to 80, really enjoying the ride here. 80 RPMs, okay, great. I'm gonna give you 18 more seconds. 18 more seconds. Phil, where's your heart rate? It was 130. All right, that's, I'll take that. Laura, uh, Stacy, how about you? 122. I'm okay. Okay. That's okay. That's okay. <laughs> Everyone, remember the resistance you have. Pull it back. 70 RPMs. Recover. Okay. Great. Great. All right, guys. That was fabulous. That was fabulous. Really good. Really good. That's why we've been searching for those numbers. We've been searching for those numbers. Okay. Great. Stacy, what was your resistance there? 34. 34. Okay. All right. <laughs> Kathy, um, I need to go. I gotta, okay, honey. Are, are you going to post this class later? Yes, I will. Okay, I'm yes, going to cycle will. later. Okay? okay, that sounds thank great. You. Okay. okay, hope everything's okay. okay. Okay, Okay. thank you. Okay. You're welcome. You're welcome. All right, guys, we've got two minutes, 20 seconds to recover. So that at 70 RPMs, that's going to drop your heart rate way back. It's going to drop it way back. It's not going to be a warm-up heart rate, but it's going to drop it back. It's going to. Now you have two, we have two schools of thought here. Is it better just to get there and then kick it up higher? Or is it better to build it back up and then do it again? It's just so difficult to make those decisions. So we do it both ways, right? We do it both ways. All righty, now you've got to think about what we're going to be doing now. We're going to go back to that 85 RPMs when we begin. Now, if Stacy didn't get to those RPM, uh, the heart rate that we were looking for, she's going to add another resistance turn. I'm so sorry, Stacy. I'm so sorry. I know it. I know. Well, I'm sorry, not sorry. Right, Lori? Yeah. Okay. Um, but those of you who got there, brilliant. That's great. Those of you who are still working towards that, that's okay. We can do that. So our next block, our next block is going to be six minutes long. So when we start at 85, 85 we're going to stay there for four we're going to stay there for one minute okay we'll pull back to 80 and then we'll accelerate to 90 we'll hold the 90 for 40 seconds we'll pull back to 80 for 20 all right so we're going to keep doing that six times for six minutes all right are you guys ready feel good all right let's go let's go 85 rpms just go ahead, just go ahead, go ahead. 85 RPMs, 85 RPMs. I want you to get to the, add the resistance in that you had on your last effort. Stacy's gonna add one more resistance turn. If you can, Stacy, I'm, I'm asking you a lot, I know. All right, okay, 85 RPMs. Allow the heart rate to start to build back up again. Start to build it back up again. Everyone's good. Polina, you did great. You did really great today. Congratulations. Thank you. You're so, welcome. Dear. Thanks a lot. So I'll leave the session and okay. hopefully I'll come on Thursday. That's wonderful. Thank you, Polina. Thank you. Good Thank job. you. Have a nice day. You too.
20 seconds to go. We are at 85 RPMs. How's everyone's heart rate handling this? Good? All right, good, good. All right, you got 10 seconds. All right, here we go, guys. Five, four, three, two, pull it back. 80 RPMs, now hold this. Okay, great. How many got to their aerobic threshold on that? Did you get there? Okay, all right, good. Some Most of you are still searching for that, right? Mm -hmm. All right, just hold it here, hold it here, hold it here. Okay, now take a deep breath. Take a deep breath. I want you to accelerate to 90 and hold it for 40 seconds. Hold it for 40 seconds, push it up. Yes, great, great, great. So Deborah, you're at an eight, right? Yeah. Yeah. Susan, are you still at plus three? Yes. Okay, good. Stacy, you added a resistance turn, right? Yes. Okay, good, good. Carolina, you doing okay? Yeah. All right, good, good. Norma, you feeling okay? Yes. All right, good. Okay, 10 more seconds at 90. We're going to pull back to 80. Get ready, get ready. We've got four, three, two, 80 RPMs, pull it back. Okay, nothing slower than 80. Grab your water if you need it. Your mouth is going to get dry here because you're going to be riding with open, open mouths probably towards the end. All right, good. All right, we've got 10 seconds until we accelerate again to 90. We're not, Deborah, heart rate's going to go up higher than aerobic threshold. Okay, here we go. 90 RPMs for 40 seconds. Let's do it. That's right. That's right. We're getting, we're, we're, we're increasing that chemical in our brain for neuroplasticity in our brain. That's what we're doing right now. The BDNF, that's what we're doing. Can you say it again? BDNF, we love it. BDNF, we want more. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, great. All right, good. Keep it going, keep it going, keep it going. Everybody can benefit from this class. Great job. Great job. Here we go. 10 more seconds. Marge, be careful. Be careful, Marge. Be careful. Yeah. All right, good. All right. Yeah. Okay. Four, three, two, pull it back. 80. Oh my gosh. Okay. You needed to pull back, didn't you? That was tough. That was tough. Phil, what's your heart rate? I'm 30. Okay. Great. Great, great, great. Stacy. 128. All right. It's coming up. Good. It's coming up. Here we go, guys. Here we go. Again, 90 RPMs for 40 seconds. Push hard. 40 seconds. Good. It's not a minute. It's not a minute. Good. All right, good. You're 10 in. You're 10 in. You're 10 in. Shoulders down, chest up. Allow the legs to do their job. Yes, that's it. Very good. Very good. Very good. 20 seconds in. 20 to go. You're almost there. You're halfway through it. Good job, good job, good job. You're almost there, almost there. This is this effort is hard. This is hard. Yes, 10 seconds to go. This is hard. Yes, five seconds to go. Four, three, two, pull it back. 80. You're halfway through this interval. If you are toast and you don't want to go any farther, you sit this next minute out. Okay. It's okay. It's okay. Those of you who are ready to go again, get ready, take a deep breath and accelerate. 90 RPMs, push it out at 90. Good, you're over halfway through this interval. Keep going, keep going, keep going. This effort is hard, this effort is hard. The heart rate's handling it, the heart rate's going up. Good job, you're 20 seconds in, keep it strong, keep it strong. Everyone okay, everyone okay. Woo, Stacy! I saw you look. What is it? 135. There you go, girl. There you go. All righty, 10 seconds to go. All righty, all righty, all righty. Five seconds to go. Get ready to pull back to 80 and four, three, two, 80. Pull it back. You got 20 seconds. Susan, what was it? 138. That is brilliant. That is brilliant. Wow, good job, here we go. You got two more minutes of this interval. That means two more intervals. Are you ready to go again? Take a deep breath, 90 RPMs, let's go fast, 90. Nothing over 90. If you're getting over 90, uh, -uh monitor that. We don't wanna go over 90. Keep it right here, keep it right here. You're 10 seconds in already. Oh boy, oh boy. 
15 in, 15 in. Good job. Hold yourself steady on that, on that saddle. Don't grip those handlebars. Keep them light. Keep those handles light, the handlebars light. Okay, 10 seconds to go. You guys are almost there. You're almost there. Hold on. Hold on, hold on. We've got five, four, three, two, 80 RPMs. Hold it. 20 seconds. Last one coming up. Last one coming up. Woo, that's right, Stacy. That's right. High intensity interval training. That's what we got here. We know so much about our bodies. So much. Here we go. Last one. Last one. Three. Great. Smart to get a drink. Good. Let's go. 90. This is it. 20 seconds. 20 seconds. I'm sorry. 40 seconds. <laughs> 20 times That's two. Cruel. I'm so sorry. I know. I'm so sorry. That was so cruel. All righty. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. 15 in, 15 in, you guys got it. 20 in, 20 in, you're halfway there, you're halfway there. Good job, good job, good job. You've got 15 seconds to go at 90. Get ready to pull it back to 80. Don't you recover yet. We've got five, four, three, two, 80 RPMs. Don't look at your heart rate. Wait till you finish up with 80. Wait till you finish up with 80. All right, good. 15 seconds to go. You'll get scared if you see your heart rate right now. Don't even look. Don't even look. Don't even pee. Okay, eight seconds to go. Oh my gosh. Five seconds to go. Four, three. Everyone grab your heart rate and you have recovery. Good job. 70 RPMs. Take your resistance off. Woo! Oh my gosh. I am so tired. Okay, great. Okay. Oh my gosh. Phil, what was yours? 135. 135 at 33? Yes. Okay, great. Steve, did you by any chance get yours? Yeah, it hit 157. And then you pulled back, my friend, right? Yeah, to about 145. That's perfect. That's perfect. Mike, how about you? 105 at 23. Brilliant job. Brilliant job. Norma? 90 at one. Oh my gosh it felt like it was 190 didn't it i could tell by your face i could tell by your face all right stacy 135 at 35 that is brilliant good job carol how did you do i got my output to 50 wonderful your output was 50 great job excellent good job you okay are you okay i am Okay, good. Okay, Lori, share with us. 139 and 90 and 39. Whoa, wonderful job. Excellent. Carolina. 113 plus three. That's perfect, Carolina. Thank you for that. Good job. Marge, tell me. 112 and then the last one was 113 and plus uh, one. That's perfect. Excellent. Great way to monitor the resistance. Good job. Good job. How about you, Susan? 139 at plus three. Ooh, good job. Great job. And how about you, Deborah? 142 at eight. That is fantastic. Great job. Wonderful job, guys. Excellent. So, so tell me, do you feel smarter? Yeah, yes. after that interval, yeah. Or do you know your name? Yeah, sometimes I didn't even know my name after a class like that. Yeah, exactly. Continue to recover. Continue to recover. We've still we got some time. Chatted. All right, what did you say? We call that for chatted. Yeah, oh, is that right? If you're no. like all over the place, can't put a thought together, that's how I was before this class, for chatted. <laughs> for chatted, I love that. Now, is that it what? is Yiddish. It's Yiddish, yeah? Oh, I love those phrases. I love those phrases. There, there must be there must be a hundred words in Yiddish that start out with fair like that, and they all mean mixed up. <laughs> really? Is that right, Deborah? Oh my gosh. Well, for Clint, for, you oh. know, it goes on and on, right? Yes. Oh my god, I love that. There's also the one that says you can't squeeze a fart from a dead man. Yes. What? I, what you can't say? squeeze a fire from a dead man. 
<laughs> that sounds like something my husband would have said yeah <laughs> I don't know if he's heard that one before oh my gosh you guys are so great okay you got 45 more seconds 45 more seconds to recover so squeeze every ounce of recovery um out of that okay I want you to kind of see where your heart rate is before we start again okay so 30 seconds to go um and I mean, it's it's smooth sailing now, guys. Smooth sailing now. You don't have to hit those heart rates this time at all, at all. We're going to start back at 85 RPMs. You're going to start and you're going to ride your aerobic threshold um, number. So it's not these high numbers, Phil, okay? Not these high numbers. Okay, five seconds, four, three. Everyone check your heart rate. Remember that. I'll ask during the ride. Go ahead, Eight, 85 RPMs. Get your heart rate right here. 85 mm -hmm. RPMs, load the resistance you had on your last effort. Same resistance. Lori, drop it back one. Okay, <laughs> drop it back one. Everyone else, I think, can you stay with that? Can you stay with that resistance? A stay theme, maybe not, maybe not. Uh, I don't know. Okay, okay, okay. Just do the best you can. Okay, now Deborah, what was your heart rate before you began? Um, right now. Just now? Yeah. Uh, I think it was about 120, maybe. Okay. Susan, what's your what was your heart rate before you began? 113. Thank you for that. Carolina? 93. Good. Marge? 89. 89. Wow, Lori. 96. I'm sorry, Marge 99. I got it. I got it. Lori? 106. Oh, wonderful. Carol, how are you feeling? You feeling good to get started again? Yes. Okay, good, good. Stacy? 110. Well, yeah, there you go, kiddo. Norma, what was your heart rate? 90. Okay, great. Mike? 94. 94. Steve, what was your heart rate before you began again? 122. 122. And Phil? 109. 109, wow. Incredible, guys. Okay, 30 more seconds to go. You're at 85 RPMs. Okay, same resistance unless I asked you to pull back, all right? So 85 RPMs, I want you to get your heart rate, but I want you to continue to ride. We have 20 more seconds here. We'll check the heart rate in 20 seconds. I'm gonna ask you to continue to ride at 85. I'm gonna ask you to lift your heart rates back up towards those numbers that we're, we're calling your aerobic threshold. Okay, five seconds, four, three, two, check your heart rate, but continue to ride. Excellent, we have three more minutes to ride. Three more minutes to ride, and then we pull back for full recovery. 85 RPMs, hopefully you're able to achieve that. Now, if 85 RPMs with the resistance that I asked you to remember is not working for you and you're not seeing the lift in the heart rate, try to increase it to 90. Some of us may just have you know, just topped out. I mean, I, I, that's not the right word. That's not a medical term at all, but that's the way I get during my rides. If I get up there and I get to that number and that I don't, I don't do the same series of efforts that got me to that number, I can't get there. So let's see how you guys do. Okay. So the numbers, we don't want those high numbers. We want your aerobic threshold number. So right about Deborah. 130, 133, nothing higher, okay? Yeah. All right, okay, good. Lori, where is it right now? 134. That's perfect, Lori. That couldn't be better. Continue to ride. Good, 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 good. Marge, how's your heart rate handling this? 106. That's perfect. Carolina, how about you? 110. 110, great. Norma, how about you? 87. Boy, that couldn't be better. Carol, how are you feeling? Perfect. Perfect. Great. Stacy, how's your heart rate handling this? 121. 121. That's fantastic. Good job. Susan, how about you? Um, I'm sticking at 135 at 80. Oh, that's okay. You're sticking at 80. Okay, great. Lori, where's your heart rate right now? 135. 135. Great. Mike, your heart rate right now? 102. Perfect. Phil, your heart rate? 134. 134, great. Uh, Phil, do me a favor and pull it back to 80. Would you pull it back to 80 for me? Steve, okay. you got one more minute to ride, guys. One more minute. Steve, how you doing? Good, 132. 
Okay, great. Good job. Okay, 50 more seconds to ride. Oh my gosh, look at you guys. You guys are fabulous. Isn't it interesting how our different our bodies are right here? How our heart rate is handling these situations. That's fantastic. You guys are fantastic. Deborah, what's your heart rate right now? Um, one, about one, well, I'm afraid it's 136, I think, 135. Okay, okay, pull it back towards 80 and hold it right there now for the rest of the 25 seconds to go. Okay, so we're not lifting it up any higher. We're kind of bringing it home. If you're at 80, brilliant. If you're at 85, brilliant. You're doing what you need to do for the last 15 seconds. That's going to be it, guys. This is going to be it. 10 seconds to go. You're going to be done. You're going to be done. Five seconds to go. You're going to be done. Four, three, two. Heart rate check. One, and you are done. Fantastic job today. Fantastic job. Lori, fill me in later on. I knew it. I knew it. Is that an optical illusion? Oh. oh, Lori, I'm so happy for you. So happy. Tell, tell, everybody, tell everybody about why we did that. They, some people logged on later. Go ahead. Yeah, we were comparing my pre-workout tremor to my post-workout tremor. And it's definitely better. It always is, though. That's great. Well, how long does it last? Usually all day. Really? Wow. Oh, wow. But That's she's good. had to pull back on all of her supplements because she's getting ready for her procedure on Thursday. Yeah. So she has no supplements on board at all. Wow. And she's still seeing a better. Let's see if it lasts all day. But you're yeah. taking, you're taking um, dopamine, right? Yeah, but I have to hold it the morning of the procedure. Mm -hmm. um, so my last dopamine will be like 10 o'clock the night before. And I'm a little like freaked out by that because <laughs> I'll be totally washed out. Yeah, it's good to it's yeah. yeah, yeah, but yeah. They I'm have sure you, to, you know. You have to. Okay. That's exciting. What, what, when is it? Thursday? Thursday. Yeah, I haven't gotten my time yet. If you guys want an update, my husband's going to be updating my caring bridge. Okay. Oh, All right. Great. Can, I will, can I'll, you I'll follow me? that. Sure. Sure. Lori, is it okay if I share that? Absolutely. Okay. Thank I'll you. Do, I'll do that. I'll do that. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. How's that? How's everybody doing? How did everybody do when I said last heart rate check? What was that? Not now. But that was like two and a half minutes ago. Phil, what was yours at the very end? 133. Perfect. Steve, did you ride to the end there? Um, it was it was about 130, 132. Okay, great, great. How about you, Mike? What was it at the end there before we recovered? 104. Good job. Good job. Norma, how about you, sweetheart? It was 89 to 31. Wow, that's incredible. Stacy, how was yours? I got a rebound to 129. <laughs> you, okay, we'll take it. All right. What well, do you want me to, well, what was it after the rebound? Uh, well, before the rebound, it was 128. <laughs> oh, that's okay. That's great. And after it's uh, 105, so I don't know. Yay, brilliant. Carol, you did okay? Yes, I did. Wonderful. Carolina, what was your heart rate at the very end there? 112. That, oh, really? It was 112, so it went back up. All right. Marge, how about you? 108. 108. Oh, my gosh. It's stuck at 108. I love that for you, kiddo. 108, 109. That couldn't be better. How about you, Susan? 133. Wow. That seems to be a good number for you. That's fantastic. And Deborah, how about you? 135. Well, great job. Excellent job. You guys were fabulous today. Thank you so much for playing along with our game today. Yeah. What's <laughs> behind door number one? Cardiovascular fitness, right? There you go. Wow. That's exactly right. Good job. All right. Roll the shoulders up, back and down. We're going to take a big cleansing breath. We're going to lift it up, inhaling, reaching up and exhaling down. We're going to take one more big breath, inhaling, reaching up. 
and exhaling all the way down. Lace our fingers behind us, walk our shoulders back, lift our chest. Oh my gosh, Lori, we are sending you such positive thoughts for Thursday. I feel it. Okay, and come all the way back, neutral shoulders, drop the hands down. Right arm comes across our chest, stretch out through the upper back and the back of the shoulder. Continue to breathe, deep breaths, good work. Reach out, palms up and the elbows, touch the finger pads to the shoulder. I did not ride this class this morning, but I can't wait to jump on my bike and ride it tomorrow. I can't wait, I'll keep you posted on my ride too. And drops down, shoulders up, back and down, good. Left arm comes across our chest, wonderful job, great, great job. Go ahead, reach straight out, palms up and the elbows. Frame your face, stretch out. Bye, Carol, you gotta go, sweetie. Bye. And slowly lower it down, roll that shoulder up, back and down. Good job, excellent. We're gonna take a big inhale, reach up. And an exhale, reach all the way out to end bar and slowly making sure those heart rates were good. You wanna come to a stop with those pedals. So feet are parallel to the floor. Yeah, front knees bent, good, good. And then when you're ready, go ahead, lift the chest, go ahead, rotate those pedals and just come to the opposite side. Continue to stretch out as you move through. Great job, great job. Slowly lift the chest, rotate those pedals. And then be mindful as you come down all the way to your saddle. Make sure you're holding on. Those were intense. That was an intense four to six minutes. Let's be honest. Well done, you guys. Make sure when you get off your bike that you're holding on to your frame so you feel like you have support. Great job. Once you're ready and you're down holding on to your bike, I'm gonna go ahead and have you try to just kick out your legs. I'm gonna find a better, yeah, maybe that's better. Good. Okay, so go ahead and kick out our legs. Good, good. We're gonna step forward with our right leg. Just step forward. Keep both heels on the floor so both feet, both heels are down. Soften your front knee enough, soften your back knee enough. Go ahead and bring both hands to our hips today. The hip that's in the back, we're gonna bring that forward. We're gonna bring that front hip back and we're gonna to try to get it side by side. Good, lift up your toes in your shoes. Can you do that? Good, don't white knuckle down with those toes. Place the feet down to the toes down to the floor. Excellent. Hands come back to our side. We're gonna bend our back knee. We're gonna sit back onto that back heel. You're gonna flex your front foot and you're gonna come down for a hamstring stretch on the right side. Good job, good job, good job, good job. So this helped us get into the proper kind of uh, stance for a good hamstring stretch. We're gonna continue this journey by pushing through our back heel, rise, you can lift up your front knee, you're gonna cross that ankle over the top of your supporting thigh, and you're gonna have a seat. Good, now you're opening up this knee as much as possible, don't help it, just continue to work through the, that stretch, stretching the right glute, good job. Come all the way back up and step down. Well done. Separate feet hip distance apart. One time, one more time, kick it out. So now we're stepping forward with our left leg. Stagger the feet, soften the front knee, soften the back knee, take hands to the hips, the leg that's in the back, the hips that's in the back, encourage it to come forward. Front hip comes back, good. Just. Find that position, excellent. Hands come back to our side. Shift the weight to your back heel, bend your back knee, flex your front foot, all the way to your supporting leg, which is the right side now. Flex that foot. Really feel the good hamstring stretch. Excellent job. Slowly rise. Lift up this knee, cross that ankle over the top of that opposite thigh, and have a seat. Whoa, that feels good, doesn't it? Feels uh -huh. really good. Stretching through that left glute. Good. Slowly rise. 
and step down. Excellent job. Shift your weight to your left foot, step back with your right. Pick your back heel up, bend both knees. Now we're gonna tuck this back hip under. So if you would like a little balance challenge, or if you would like to feel the stretch a little bit more, the leg you have in the back is the arm that you reach up with and you hinge to the opposite side. Draw the belly in. Good. Excellent job. Keep breathing. Good. Slowly lift the arm up. Hold on to your frame. You're going to shift forward onto your front foot. You're going to bend your back knee and you're going to reach back for a quadricep stretch. So knee down, hip down, doing the best you can. Lifting that torso. Well done. Slowly release it. Kick out your legs. Good. We're gonna step back with the opposite leg or your left leg. Left heel is up, balancing on the ball of that back foot. Tuck underneath this hip. The hip that's in the back is the one we wanna stretch. If you feel like you would like a little bit deeper stretch, go ahead, the leg in the back is the arm you reach up with and we hinge to the side. Good job. Good. Reach up and Slow down, great, hold on. As you transition to the front foot, put the weight forward, reach back, grab that back foot, knee down, hip down, and lengthen out. Good, really grow through that spine. Great, as we step down, kick out our legs, good. We're gonna take both hands behind us. Let's lace our fingers. Tuck our tail under, really lift the chest, good. Try not to compromise the low back. As you press the hips forward, you should feel a strong stretch through the front of those hip flexors, up through the belly. Continue your journey with your gaze and slowly return forward. Good, we're gonna hinge forward, flat back forward, keeping those fingers laced behind us. Soften the knees, excellent. Now stay in this position as we take our hands away, cup our kneecaps with our palms, finger pads on the bottom of our kneecap, tuck the chin to the chest, bring your tail in so that you feel like that tail is gonna sit down on the top of the heels and then slowly rise up. Good. Once you're standing, big inhale, reaching up. Last exhale right here. Good job, everybody. Well done today. Thank you all for coming uh, today. Great job. Do you have it? Oh, Lori. Oh, we, I sent you so much, so much, so much love, so much support. I will be back as soon as I can. Okay, good luck. Hey, yeah, good luck. Yes. Anyone have any questions or concerns about what we did or why we did it today? All right. Good. Good. Thank you. Good Thank job, you. everybody. Thank Love you. you guys. Have a Take great care. day. I'll see Thank everyone you. Thursday. Lori's got our love. Okay. Bye-bye now. Thank Bye. you.